Good morning everyone and welcome to another video. It is nice and early this morning, about 7 o'clock. Um, I got up about 6.30 but just like fluffed around in bed for a bit, did a bit of meditating and I wrote in my journal for a little bit. So trying to get like a good morning routine happening here. So today I'm going to be doing another what I eat in a day video because I love doing them for you. It's a label free vegan lifestyle thing. I just feel so much happier and healthier and I just want to share it with everyone. I want everyone to know that, you know, it's easy. It's easy to drop the label. So anyways, I'm gonna go for a run. I'll see you when I get back and then we'll just film one. I okay, so I just got back and I went around like this big block and it took me 26 minutes, 38 seconds. So it's about 5K. So that's pretty good for me considering I haven't done anything and I didn't stop once and I really pushed it at the very end so I have like a massive stitch now. But yeah, to my auntie's house, um, you might have seen her in my last What I Eat video, like her house. So yeah, I'm just staying here at my auntie's house for a couple more nights just to hang out and spend time with family. So I'm going to go inside now, get some stuff going and eat some food. <laughs> So before I thought I'd get breakfast ready, I wanted to show you guys like a body update. A few of you guys have noticed that I've lost a bit of weight since, you know, I started my journey. And yes, I have lost about 10 kilos now, about 9.5. And I'm really happy with how far I've come. Um, I just want to put it out there, like this didn't happen overnight. This was like a long journey for me. And, you know, sometimes it was really hard, but it really was just listening to my body and listening to what my body wanted and not pushing myself too much. And, you know, just dropping the label in general really helped with my body and finding, you know, my happy weight and what I feel comfortable eating and everything. And yeah, I've healed my eating disorder. I've healed my polycystic ovarian syndrome. I've healed chronic fatigue, IBS, acne, everything by eating um, this way. And I feel amazing. So without further ado, here's my body. Sorry, it's bad lighting but yeah I just kind of like pulled my leggings down but you can see like my feet are together and I've lost a fair bit of weight in my thighs because I used to, they never used to be like that they used to always like touch and you can just see some more definition in my stomach which I'm really happy about I have like kind of bigger hips as you can see um, I've always had that but yeah, it's just about having the love handles, which I don't really have anymore. Um, and I don't mind because I love my hips. And this is the side, as you can see. And the back, if you can see. Hello. Um, but yeah, I used to have like a lot of back fat happening there. But as you can see, I don't really have any anymore. Um, just have this skin. And I'm, I see more definition in my arms now. There's my body update. <laughs> um, I don't do any ab exercises. This is literally just from being normal. So hopefully I'll be able to tone that up a bit more when I start doing some weights and stuff. So yeah. So that's my body update. I can do like a full talking video about it and how I came this far another time. First, I'll just focus on what I eat today, won't we? So yeah, but at the end of the day, it just comes down to loving your body and loving the skin that you're in. And once I think that you do that, everything else just falls into place. It really does. So yeah, I'm starving. Let's go eat. This morning, I am having the Old Faithful Wheat Bix, which I love and I'm obsessed with lately. All cereals, really. Okay, I'm going to have four Wheat Bix, I think. Oh, I'm going to make it look a little bit pretty. So I can take a nice photo of it, I think. And now I'm just going to put some nut and seed mix that my auntie made. It's got almonds, pumpkin seeds, dried fruit, cashews, sunflower seeds. Yeah. There we go. And now I'm going to put some fresh blueberries on top. And I'm going to chop up some banana. Oh, I don't want that one in there. Oops. And here's the finished product. Yum, yum, yum. And all I've got to do is add the milk. 
Okay, so I've just had a shower. I'm ready. So I've got the house to myself until the kids come home. I'll be meeting a friend this afternoon for a drink, as in like coffee or a smoothie or something, not an alcoholic drink, if you guys were wondering. But for now, I'm just going to sit here and do some study. And I also always have water beside me and I drink about, but I have like three or more liters a day. So yeah, let's get cracking to some work. Quick study break and I'm on the phone to Henya. Wait, she's she's gonna say hello in a minute. <laughs> the internet's really bad. Wait. Can you see me? I can't see you, wait. Your camera's not on. Wait. There she is. Hello. <laughs> oh my god, the internet is so bad. Everyone go check out Henya Mania. Go go to her channel. She's amazing and I love her. <laughs> okay, so it's lunchtime and I'm looking a bit red in this light. I don't know what's happening there, but anyways. And now I'm starving and I'm going to make some lunch. Oh, there, the redness is gone. Okay, so I'm going to make sushi because it is like super easy. I'll show you what I've got so far. I've got some rice, which I just cooked up in the microwave it's really easy and i just put one cup of rice in there with a little bit of sushi seasoning for focuses and some water of course and cook that for 10 minutes it seriously doesn't take that long i've got some baby cucumbers i've chopped up with some carrot and this is the rice that we've got it's like this special extra fancy premium rice so it's like sushi rice up the top there so that's really good and i've just got some nori here and a mat that i will roll it up please bear with me i'm terrible at rolling sushi but i'm going to try my best since you're pretty as soon as you came in the door i just want to chill got a sack for us to roll married to the money introduced it to my stove showed her how to whip it Okay, so it's like really long and skinny, but now I know I can put more rice in it. And there you have it. Here's my sushi. So I finished my lunch and for the last couple of hours I've just been like chilling. Now I'm just going to have a quick snack and then I'm going to go meet my friend and get outside in the sun. I'm really excited. So I'm going to have some toast. So I've got some bread here. It's like this multi-grain just from the supermarket. Just a plain and simple one. It's vegan and I'm just going to have it with some peanut butter because I love this. Seriously, this is heaven. So good. It's that good. I decided to have two pieces of these. Oh, seriously. Warm peanut butter on toast, like when it melts a little bit, it's heaven. So I'm at Mia's house. Mia, say hello to YouTube. Hi. And she's making us a juice. And I'm sorry I forgot my camera at home, so I'm using my iPhone at the moment. So hopefully I have enough space. But what have you got? We've got watermelon. We've got rock melon. Pineapple. Yeah, nice. Orange. <laughs> mango. <laughs> oh my God. And mint. <laughs> what a treat. All my favorite in one. <laughs> That's I haven't seen Mia in ages. She's like my big little sister as well. I've known her since she was like born, pretty much. Or 16. <laughs> or 16. Because <laughs> close enough. <laughs> You're just 12. <laughs> You're just 12. Oh, she's like my little sister I've never had, to be honest. Anyway, because like she's got tan, tan skin sometimes. <laughs> yeah, tan skin. <laughs> Says the Asian. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, we're going to have some friend time and we're going to have our smoothie juice things. Bye, Mia. So I'm back from seeing Mia and I'm back with my little cousin Serena. If you guys remembered her from my last video, she's starring in a lot of my What I Eat in a Day videos, aren't you? We're just going to hang out. It's such a nice afternoon. So it's dinner time now and my amazing auntie Josie <laughs> is making me some rice paper rolls. I'm very lucky. She's done a very good job here. So it's got like rice and rice noodles, tofu, carrot, cucumber. Is cucumber or zucchini? No, zucchini. Zucchini. Just making me some more there. Yeah, and that's my dinner. 
So I finished dinner and it was absolutely amazing. Um, and now we're going to watch some TV and have some family time, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> so I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Hi, Dominic. Hi. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys next video. This is how we do it.